In this module, we will discuss about coalesce or NVL function and case when statements and a decode statement. Coalesce or NVL. Suppose if we have a table like this, ID and the primary customer name and secondary customer name. Now, I need the customer name for application 103. What will you give? Do you need to check the primary customer name? Then it is null. Then you need to obviously give the secondary customer name, Tom. So, in such scenario, we need to give at least one name. So, we will take the first occurrence value. We will write the following statement. Select coalesce of primary customer name, comma secondary customer name. This function basically looks for the first value, primary customer name. If it is available, it will return that value. If not, it will look for the second value and it will give. Likewise, you can select n number of columns and give the values. You can further replace coalesce with NVL. NVL is easy to remember and both the functions are same. And decode. Decode and case when. Like in other programming languages, we use the condition if else, if else and go on with nested if else. So here we can use case when and a nested case when. Let's see this. Now, earlier we have seen coalesce or NVL function to pick the values. Now, if I need to check primary customer name and if it is not available, then I should go and pick the secondary customer name. In this case, I can write a case when statement saying select case when primary customer name is equal to null, then secondary customer name, else primary customer name and as customer name from sample table. This will yield the result of the available customer. Here, like in other cases, I am not writing the condition as primary customer name is null. I am not writing the word is null because in redshift for strings, we need to use is equal to and two single quotes to define that. Whereas if it is a number, I can type the statement is null and decode function. Decode. Decode is same. Now if I have nested values like primary customer customer name, secondary customer name, ternary or maybe the fourth one or fifth one. So I will keep on writing case when available on first, case when available on second column, case when available on third column. In such a scenario it will be difficult to read the big long case when statement. So I will just go ahead with a simple one. Decode. Decode of primary customer name if that is null then secondary customer name else primary customer name in the same way you can further go along typing primary customer name comma double quote comma secondary customer name comma two single quotes comma ternary customer name comma two single quotes likewise and the last statement would be the else part which is primary customer name You can check that with this following statement. Select ID, decode of. If ID is 101, then I'm going to type it as 101. If it is 102, then 102. If it is 103, it is 103. Or else 104. So you can keep on typing that. And you can test your decode function. And by writing these two examples on case when and decode, you will understand the full concept. Thank you.